Yeah, what a great question. I still remember when like my friends' moms were telling me they were getting on Facebook, and I was like, "Wow, okay, it's now the it's a real deal." So that was in the two thousands, and um, I think right up until sort of like Snowden, I think was when I first started to detect a kind of a turn on tech and concerns about privacy and surveillance um, advertising, and then my study, the emotional contagion study, I think had a big um, sort of push on people being worried about what these companies were capable of doing. I, I don't think people really had a good idea that, you know, they could be manipulated or that there were algorithms involved, all this stuff. And now they do. Um, you know, and since then there's been other scandals and I think the coverage of Facebook in particular has been really negative. And so, yeah, I think the attitudes towards big tech, but social companies in particular have gotten pretty negative. And you know Microsoft just passed the trillion dollar mark, and at the same time gets almost no negative press. And I think part of it is because they're not very social, and they're not—I mean, except for gaming—but they're also not. Um, you know, people don't think of them as like an algorithm, data collection kind of place. So yeah, it's it's been a big change.